At the Decker Performance Center, our philosophy is built around a four pillar approach to development. Training, recovery, nutrition, and mental skills are all central components to uh, the development process for all of our athletes. We feel as though if we develop the whole athlete first, uh, rather than zooming in too closely, uh, we'll have better short-term and long-term results with our physical development plan. Uh, the benefits of our training plan at the Ducket Center are multifold, really. Uh, with our younger athletes, we, it's you know more about developing confidence and physical abilities, uh, developing physical literacy, and increasing their range or uh, bandwidth of, of motor skills from a young age. Uh, with our older athletes, and when they start to figure out which direction they want to take their sporting endeavor, and they you know start to peel back the layers a bit and figure out what some of the physical deficiencies are that may be holding them back. Uh, from getting to the next level or, or leapfrogging peers, then we can get a bit more nuanced and, and, and try to have more targeted uh, adaptations you know, through, our, through our training and through our development. I've been here for three years and the main thing I noticed personally myself physically is the strength component. I used to work out at a couple different gyms and Bantam and those years, but one thing I noticed here was I got stronger. And I think having the DPC is a really essential part of hockey. Well, I've definitely got physically stronger and I had an injury at one point and with the DPC I was able to come back from it stronger than before and yeah, it's really just improved everything. Coming in after school hours and just having the availability to it has definitely has improved and helped my development at that time. Getting that ice, of course, and like having the rink when you're in school is awesome. But then right after going on the ice and coming in for a lift, it's so beneficial and I honestly, I couldn't imagine it not being here. It would just be so weird. I mean, where would we go, you know? And it just, I don't think we'd get out as much as what we do having it. When an athlete leaves here with quantifiable improvements in their physical development, um, just they feel better, uh, they start to look different. Um, that has profound positive impacts on our athletes. Uh, you know, their self-confidence and their self-image. And that's fun for our athletes, and especially being in such an influential, uh, influential time of their lives. Uh, but that's super rewarding for us as coaches as well. I think it's built confidence for my mindset working out because now when I work out at home or if I go to a different gym, I know the complexes and I know the form. I'm just more confident in doing the exercises that I've been talking about. We ask the athletes to come in here every time and have you know, focused intention and effort with their training. Um, we ask them to be consistent. When you're in a team environment, I mean, that's a little bit easier. Uh, one of the great benefits of being at the Edge School is the coaches, you know, they make sure they, they, they plan in the training sessions for the athletes so they, the consistency things all taken care of for them. Um, and they also have to have belief in our program. You know, having face value, uh, or when something has face value or when you really, really believe in it, the consistency and the effort takes care of itself. And in order to, to garner that belief in our athletes, uh, we think as coaches it's really important that we educate our athletes. Uh, we want our athletes to always know why we're doing what we're doing and we encourage them to ask as many questions as they need to get there. And we also try to create an environment that athletes want to be in. I think Ross, Alyssa, Trevor, they've all been great and it's nice having more than one coach that knows what they're talking about. So. If, let's say, I come in and Alyssa's not here, I can ask Ross because they're all so on the same page. They account for the details rather than just, okay, try to lift this. So it's been really specific in the sense of now you know what you're actually doing in the workout. A lot of times the team, you know, the team culture will take care of, of the environment. When athletes come in as individuals, which they do in the summer months uh, and the out-of-school out of months, uh, that's our chance to really curate and, and be very purposeful and intentional about the environment we create. Um, and it's electric. That's something we do really well. Uh, it, it's something to see for sure. It's very high intensity, high energy, and athletes consistently comment on you know, how excited they are to get back every year just to become uh, a piece of that environment again. In the summer, I'd say it's more competitive because we have people coming back from where they are in the university. They'll come back to our groups. We have ex-NHL guys, um, WHL guys, all sorts of things. So everyone kind of been doing stuff like this for a long time so you push off one another and then within your team you kind of have certain weight groups that you go with so you can push one another and I think it's just it's a healthy environment. During the summer seeing those pro athletes it's all uh, I mean it's where I want to be so definitely just see how they're working and try to mimic it. It's really rewarding for us as coaches when athletes come back they've graduated from school 
you know, four, six, eight, maybe even ten years ago, um, you know, just to become part of that environment again. They obviously have their own individual uh, goals and aspirations with what they want to do with their, you know, their physical self, at, you know, as it pertains to their sporting career. Um, but a lot of them come back because they, they love the environment that, that we create. They get to see the other athletes that are around. And we, we really create um, an off-season team uh, at the Duck Performance Center. I come here all year. I come here during the summer, and it definitely feels like its own little team. And uh, I definitely like that, where I can just come and I feel at home.